How often have you heard someone say, or perhaps you've said it yourself, things happen for a reason? Well, you know what? I don't, I don't know. I don't know if things happen for a reason. I do know that things happen. There's a variant on that that I'm sure you've heard too. And today I had an insight about the value of keeping it short and simple. Things happen. When we think or hold that things happen for a reason, we get our personal minds wrapped up in decoding the reasons of the universe or of God or of divine, divine mind or whatever. And if there are such reasons, I'm pretty sure they're none of my business. If I get caught up, when human beings get caught up in decoding those reasons, we take the resources we have for encountering, experiencing, and responding to what happens, and we use some of those resources to figure out why is it happening. It seems to me it actually works better to just use those resources to meet what happens as it happens. It would be like an artist who starts to make a paint stroke and then goes, why am I doing that? What moved me to make that? What's the deeper meaning of that paint stroke? Is that the right paint stroke? Am I on my path if I make that paint stroke? Is this paint stroke part of my purpose? I imagine, right? It'd be crazy. The artist simply needs to make the paint stroke and then see what happens. Imagine a surfer out on the waves and a wave comes up or there's a shift in the wind and the surfer goes, there's a deeper meaning to that shift in the wind and gets caught up in interpreting it and admiring it and focusing on how fortunate they feel that they notice the shift in the wind. And meanwhile, they've gotten knocked on their butt by the wave, right? It may be that things happen for a reason, but as one of my mentors, George Pransky says, that's beyond my pay grade. What I know for sure is that things happen and that human beings are designed to experience and respond to what happens. And that every human being has the resources to respond, not to manage, not to control, not to pre predict, but to respond. That's where our genius is, and that's where our attention belongs, I think. Let me know how this lands with you. I look forward to hearing from you. Bye-bye.